As summer temperatures rise, cows everywhere suffer from heat stress. So, barns are being built to move cows indoors. Lots of fans are being installed. Soakers and misters are flowing. All to help cows keep cooler and keep milking. In this video, we use thermal imagery to show you things your eyes alone can't see. We'll talk about what's hot, what's cool, and how the choice of stall base might be affecting cows. We'll help you see things you can't, so you know how the temperature of the stall base can affect cow comfort. For better cow health, better milk production, and better reproduction. Let's talk about heat stress. Thermal energy, or heat, transfers from hot to cold. When it's cold, your body easily gives up heat to your surroundings. But when it's hot, and worse, hot and humid, it's harder to get rid of excess heat. That can lead to heat stress. The same thing can happen to cows. The decision to bed cows with sand, with mattresses, with compost or manure solids, or with water beds may affect cow cooling in the stall. Let's first talk about sand bedding. Sand is a good insulator. It traps the heat transferred into it and right where the cow lies. Look at this cow in a sand stall. Nothing unusual, right? The thermal image of this cow tells a different story. The heat is concentrated right where the cow's udder was. You see how the sand traps the heat beneath the cow? That spot is almost as hot as she is. That sand isn't doing anything to help cool her. Now, let's talk about mattresses. Mattress cushioning usually comes from either foam or ground rubber. And, just like similar materials that are used for insulation, Mats that rely on foam and rubber for comfort are insulating the cow from the cool ground beneath her. Just look at the thermal version of this photo. It's over 97 degrees where she was lying. And all that body heat is trapped in all the wrong places. Since the single chamber water bed relies on a foam layer for comfort, when it comes to heat, it performs similarly to mats. Look here. This is a single chamber water bed cow had just left the stall. The thermal image shows just how hot this bed is. That's not offering any cooling. Hotter still are composted manure solids. Heat is a normal part of the composting process. And as soon as that compost goes into the stall, the heat goes with it. Like we saw in the hot sand stall, these manure solids are over 98 degrees. Here's another look. We dug a heel into this freshly filled and groomed manure solid stall. With the thermal camera, it looks like this. Nearly 100 degrees right below the surface. That's almost as hot as the cow. So what can you do? DCC water beds are the answer. Since cow comfort comes from just the volume of water, the cows benefit from the cool ground beneath the bed. You see, cool ground temperatures beneath the platform transfer through the concrete into the water chambers. That means a cooler surface for the cow to help take away some of her body heat. Here's a DCC waterbed in a barn. This cow had just gotten up and here's the thermal image. Notice how the bright red hot spots that you saw on the other stall surfaces are instead cooler yellows and oranges on the DCC waterbed. And that cooler surface means heat is transferred away from the cow. And when combined with other cooling systems, DCC waterbeds can help lessen the impact of heat stress. So keep putting fans in your barn Keep using sprinklers and misters, and give your cows DCC waterbeds for the coolest comfort in the stall.